Oh, how are you feline? Haha, <laughs> get it? Welcome back. Well, this is Maine Coon Kitten just starting its career as a show cat. And coming up in August, Wisconsin will be host to the greatest show on earth. I'm not kidding. It's not the circus. It is the Great Lakes Regional Cat Show put on by the Wisconsin Illinois Cat Fanciers. And right now I'm joined by some members. It's Liz Hansen, RJ Dominic, and Paige, who is the owner of Stash on your who's got a half stash, kind of, really. <laughs> and Stash is what, the number one household pet in the world? Is that yes. true? How how do you come to own the number one household cat in the he entire can't. universe? Not exactly sure. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, what makes a, a good a show cat, or, or why? What makes Stash special? I guess. Well, just to kind of give you an introduction, when we show our cats, there's different classes. And for example, the two main coon kittens that are just starting out, they're four months old, and that's the youngest as far as them starting their show <laughs> career. And they would be the kittens are competing in the purebred cat kitten category. Stash, who is a purebred ragdoll, but as you can see from his name and his markings, he's actually what we call a mismarked ragdoll. Oh. So Stash competes in the household pet category. So in fact, none of the cats sitting up here, um, except for the two kittens, compete against each other. And so as oh. far as, as Stash being in the household pet, just like with any cat, we look for a good disposition, playful, sweet. Um, and in the household pet, that's really the number one characteristic that the judges are looking for. So it's not so much looks or their coat or not their eyes? Not for the household pet, it isn't oh, okay. at all. For the, the pedigreed cat, when they compete, absolutely. Every, every cat breed has a written standard, just like it would for a, a purebred dog, what it's supposed to look like. Um, Rudy here, the Somali, has, of course, a different look and a different standard than the main, than the main coons <laughs> do. Look at the way he's holding it. I know. That's over. Do that again. <laughs> like is that how you would show a cat, or is that just how they fly? Uh, that's how you would bring them to the bring them to the ring. So. Oh, you would. Yeah. Like so this. you would Whoa. stretch them out. To, uh, <laughs> you're not really supposed to do this. The show show the length of the cat to the oh. judge it, to, if they happen to if they'd happen to see him going by, but. Uh, the judges will pull oh, them out stash. and stretch them like that as well. They will. Especially for the breed like the Maine Coon, the wow, Somali. Look, look how long yeah. their bodies are. I don't know if we yeah. can get a shot hey, where you can see out, how buddy. long there their bodies go, are. Piper. There you go. Yeah, yeah. Stretch out, look Piper. Look at that. So they're still oh. a little wiggly. They're just learning at four like months. Like a cat sandwich. Okay. <laughs> cat sub. <laughs> Oh, so cute. So there's going to be, what, 250 cats from around the world coming to this Correct. competition to compete? Correct. Correct. Yes, that's right. Kit we'll have kittens there, adult cats, um, spayed and neutered cats, and then the household pet class as well. Cats Who, from all over the country. Who's making that noise? Which cat that's is that? Would be, that would be, oh. No, that would be Rudy. That's Rudy. That's Rudy. <laughs> is, he, is he happy or not happy? Not incredibly. Oh, okay. None of these cats live together. None of these cats live together. Okay, so do really they not cat. like each other right now? They or? don't really know each other. And the kittens, I don't think, probably know enough to, you, to, you know, be concerned about the other cats. But Rudy's three, and he knows that, you know, he's top dog in his house, and <laughs> and uh, he would prefer not to be around. I'm sure the youngsters, especially. Oh, so. oh, okay, Rudy. I love but that you just called him a top dog yeah. in his house. That's <laughs> awesome. Yeah. There's junior exhibitors too. This mm -hmm. is something that people can mm -hmm. get involved in. Can you actually learn how to show? Oh, look at you, Kate. Oh, you, you, Kate. You. Oh, that's so cute. Oh, can that's people so cute. get their pets involved? Oh, yes, keep sure, playing. absolutely. If you have a purebred cat or if you just have a regular household pet and you'd like to compete in the show, um, I recommend you get in touch with um, somebody from our show committee. And I know your show has the information on your website. Get, yeah. a, get a hold of one of us and we'd be happy to help you out. The kids as well. We have a junior program and we encourage kids as young as five to do some do the junior program um, in the International Cat Association. At first I thought Tiffany's <laughs> stomach was growling. And she was a little what hungry. It, like it does. Mm -hmm. What are all your ribbons for? Uh, all these ribbons show all the awards <laughs> that the judges have given all, all of our cats. None of these are specific to exactly Like, what are they for, Rudy. though? Uh, Whoa, Rudy. <laughs> Rudy. Bye, Rudy. Bye, Rudy. Bye, Rudy. Rudy. Okay, Rudy left. He jumped over the couch. <laughs> <laughs> the ribbons are what we win at the show, actually. Unfortunately, yeah. it's not money. Uh, we compete for ribbons okay. and for points, and they, they accumulate over an entire calendar year. Oh, and hi, so, Rudy. for example, as you were saying, Stash is the number one household pet cat right now, which okay. means he's got the most points. He's defeated the most number of other household pet cats in okay. the country. Did you? Where's that cat from? Um from one of the breeders that is in our uh, cat club. In Wisconsin. That's okay. Outside Madison. Okay, and are, do, you, do you breed cats to be 
house, the number one household <laughs> pet in the in the world? Not or? usually. As a breeder, we're looking for the pure. We would like the, the purebred pure cats to mm -hmm. be number one. Um, Stash is remember Stash with is marked. mismarked, mm -hmm. so he can't compete with other purebred ragdolls right. because just because of the markings. Just yeah. that nose just, thing yep. that ha he's got half a stash, half a stash and not full that's stash. Right. That's right. I love he, that one. When he turns his head like that, he's a good looking cat. He, he is a beautiful. good looking cat. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I think, you know, why do you think cats are such a good companion? I mean, they're, they're like the number one companion for busy people. I just th think they're... I'm a, I'm a bona fide cat lady. <laughs> so. I am too, and, and I'm busy myself, and I think they're easy to have, mm -hmm. and they sleep so much, unlike dogs. They don't have to be let outside. Um, you know, they, they use the litter box, and if we're gone for 12, 14, 16 hours a day, the cats are okay with that. They sleep. Um, they're not neglected um, as long as they see us, I think, yeah, a few hours a day. People they're they're make, pretty happy and easy. People sometimes make fun of cat people that they're like, Little like cuckoo, or that I you'll, you know, you'll be unmarried, you know, the, for a long time and just own a lot of cats. It's true. But I think the thing is, for, for people who love cats and, and have beautiful cats like mm -hmm. this, you can see why they make such great Absolutely. pets, why people take such pride in them. Absolutely. It's That's amazing. Right. Absolutely. I know there's going to be adoptables there as well, yeah. and we want to make sure everybody has the information for the Great Lakes Regional Cat Show. It's coming up in August. It's the 9th, 10th, and 11th, and you can visit them there at the Waukesha Expo Forum building, and it's wis ill catfanciers.com for Illinois Cat Fanciers, and they are just adorable. I want to keep this That one. is hilarious. Is this one Piper? That's Piper. I want to keep Piper. Piper. Thank you so much You're for being welcome. here. Thank you for guys. having us. You've sure. cat to be kidding me. <laughs> you heard that one? I'm not sure you have. Heard them all.